I'm back and I went to the thrift store near my nail place and um, anyway it, I only go there it's it's a ways away it's kind of way out of the way so like I said got my nails done and I, it's okay it's just not real springy I don't know I you know I go on Pinterest I find a picture and she really I guess focused on the black I didn't in the picture notice anyway whatever the gal is so nice, I don't want to go, ah, I don't like, you know, I'm just not one of those people. So, I am been really into growing my plants. So, and I need to um, put one or one, some, one into a bigger pot. And this is a really nice, like, Japanese type. It doesn't have the base, but that's okay. I'll just put a plate under there. Or one of the clear things. And this was $3.99. And it's dirty inside, but I'm going to put dirt in it. So, really, who cares? Okay, this is nothing exciting, but for, what was this, $3.99, I look for things like this, because Dollar Tree ones you shouldn't use, they're bad, I guess they start fires and stuff, so I shouldn't do that. So for $3.99, this is a good Amazon Basics one. And, okay, this one in a melon party, I'm going nuts with it. It's just, my daughter-in-law's probably like, what the heck is she doing? <laughs> knows them a little crazy but look what i found and i've been wanting one of these for the trailer anyway one in a melon oh my gosh it's glass it's got a metal lid it's in perfect condition i don't know if it's old or anything no it's not but i just thought oh hd designs made in china but i'm sorry look at this so i had one of those little ones from dollar tree and i want to have I don't tend to drink the water because you put stuff in the water for the winter um, so it doesn't antifreeze, trailer antifreeze. I just feel weird in the water. Anyway, so I like to just have a big thing of water there. So there we go. There's my water. And I'll just fill it up here at the house, take it out there. And then I have purchased these um, in the past off of Amazon and I found, you gotta kind of dig sometimes. These are DVD, and they're great for organizing stamps in, so by season or holiday. And they're just meant to be, you can usually, these were $3.99, and I got two of them in there. It's usually Blu-ray, DVD, but I don't use them for that. It's kind of a totally Tiffany idea, only there's stuff like this on Amazon. So, like, I have a couple with Christmas stamps in them and then we have one with baby stamps wood stamps is what i'm talking about so you can find these but they're clear so two ooh, brand new sealed in the pack it's like wow well, okay i'll take those okay and i found stamps don't always so i'm not really sure what this is stamps of life and for a bag of them, $5.99, and Impression Obsession was what attracted me. Loving Life is what this one says. This is right there, and it's outlined. Oh. And me hugs, so these cute little, see, brand new. Like a scored, people. Cute. Oh my gosh, see, I didn't see everything that was in a bag, so... Look at that. That's cool. So you have them individual, which is kind of a pain. Just saying. Very cute, though. You can make your own little stencil. Okay. And this one is Delightful Word Kit Die. I don't know what it says. Hmm. I think it says delightful. Yeah. <laughs> Hello. Delightful word die. Okay. You're probably, we're all yelling at him. It says delightful. It says delightful, you guys. There you go. There it is. Can you see it? It's the end of the week. Okay. I don't know if this is from Stamps of Life. It's your day to sparkle. It's got gems on it and things. Cute. There's that. Then in there were these sunglasses. I believe this is also Stamps of Life. 
I think somebody, because a lot of the stamps I got have the same name written on them. So somebody either retired from crafting or retired from life or just said, you know what, I don't want to do this anymore. Anyway, it's different sunglasses or different glasses. But what I was wondering is, where's the... Be patient. Thinking they don't, none of them have the, you know, that. <laughs> that part. Let's see. Oh, okay. Oh, you could do shaker. Because there's the top, there's the bottom. Boom. Oh, cute. There's these funky donkeys. Guy air, aviator glasses. Cute. That'd be cute on a teddy bear. They're pretty big, though. Oh, this is cute. And look at the horn rim. Oh, I love it. I do believe, if you know, let me know below, but I think these are Stamps of Life. Oh, I think I did good. And there's one more in here, Take It Easy. Did I already do that one? I don't know. Okay. So yeah, $5.99. Score! I like it. They're starting to just bag them and rather than individually, so I think you're getting a better deal. At least a few, loving life, yeah. Take it easy. Okay. Got a lot of projects ahead of me in my retirement. Oh my god, I don't know why it hit. Today I wore my t-shirt. And here's my... Okay, can you see? No. Let me go this way. <laughs> Not very bright. Okay. Can you see my check mark? I got two check marks now. Can you see it? Am I on? Anyway. 39 days to go. Eight Fridays. We are out on a Friday. Because we had one snow day. All right. And then for this bag, I paid $6.99. I have no idea. And I'm not going to watch back to see how that went. So I don't know if you saw it or not. So there was stuff in here I really didn't care about. But some cute ones, too. Thinking of you from Stampin' Up. For you. That's cute. Stamp it up as well. I don't know. Look at that. Huh. Happy birthday. Stamp it up. So these are good to just have like this in the for you. You're invited. Mm, yeah, no, probably won't keep that. But I bought it. I think this says Barb on it. Barb got rid of her stamps. And I believe, what is this? Rose Basket, Sandy Gore Evans, Suzanne Cruz Productions, Uptown Rubber Stamps. Look at that basket and those flowers. Won't that be fun to color? I got that one, and that's these are the big ones are why I bought it. What does this say? Wishing you sunshine and sunflowers all year round. Well, this would go really cute together. I don't know who did this one. Dots. Which used to be, that was originally what close to my heart, I believe, was Happy Anniversary. I don't have many of those, so that's a good one to have. A zebra, you see? No, no. Girl, my granddaughters will like that one. Mystery. Ooh. All right, but here's the, the reason I bought it. Iris PSX, 1992. Isn't that gorgeous? That'll be so fun to color up. Wow. So really, really, that and this big one are the two reasons. This made me think of Anna White. She's got such a great, where she colors, and she designs a lot of dyes and stamps. Oh, this is cute. So I like that. For you. So these are just kind of cute just to put on a tag or... Intrigue. See, these must be book. I don't think I'd do that. Anyway, Note of Love. Oh, I remember this set. With all my heart, hugs and kisses, happily ever after. I used to have that set. I probably still do. I don't know. When I, I used to sell Stampin' Up! years ago. But they got so weird about what you could, you could only use their, I don't know. It just got too... I just wanted to create for the fun of it, not just be Stampin' Up. So, and they do have lovely stuff. I do love Stampin' Up, but I don't like to be 
confined or have rules. <laughs> All right, then I bought one more stamp set, and then I'm done. This was $4.99, but that's some good ones in there, I believe. Oh, look at this. I like they're doing the Ziploc bag, so it's easier I can look a little bit. So this is coffee cups. That's cute. Look at that steam. Birthday cake. Very pretty. This is, I don't know who this is, but Becky got rid of this one. Thanks, Becky. <laughs> Stamps. Stamp of Excellence. Oh, this is an oldie from the stamp box for $5.70. Back in the day, that's a lot of money. I mean, the wood alone must have cost. This is gorgeous. And this is Art Impressions. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Again, Anna White makes me... I swear, I don't think this has ever been used. I can't tell. And if it has, they clean it up really good. Somebody's pounding. Okay, almost there. Then, this pretty one, birthday. How fun is that? Happy birthday. This one is gently used. Not bad. And you always just want to check to make sure this isn't cracked and that the foam, when you push on it, it kind of gives a little bit. And then this one... Pedal, yeah, PSX 1995. Oh my gosh, look at that, you guys. Isn't that gorgeous? These are just fun. Sometimes I use stamps as decoration out on my shelves and things, because look at that. Isn't that pretty? House Mouse is fun to put out just for giggles. and So there you go. All right. Whew. I think that's it. I was a bad girl yesterday. I was a really bad girl, but I did it for you guys, because I thought, oh, I've got to... And then in line, there was a gal in front of me, and I go, oh, I'm a teacher, you know, blah, blah, blah. and she goes, me too. She teaches the same school as my daughter-in-law, so then we got talking about that, and and she had this beautiful, like, jacket on with all this, looked like hand-painted, it wasn't, but I mean, silky, with all these flowers, and then her shoes were a little, she goes, I go, what do you teach? And she goes, art, and I go, that's what I thought, so just had that look, you know, arty. All right, guys, if I don't talk to you till tomorrow... Talk to you soon. All right. Take care. Bye-bye.